used to work here when this first when this place was first built. Late one night, I heard a strange noise coming from the grid. I went up to investigate, and someone or something pushed me. I fell to my death, which was declared an accident. I left one of my gloves on the grid. It's still there. I know, I checked. I guess nobody ever bothered to pick it up. So you're probably wondering why I chose to haunt the Clark Center. Well, I can't leave. <laughs> I've tried. Can't step foot off the property. So I've had to find ways to amuse myself here. At first, I only watched the various auditions, rehearsals, and shows. But soon I grew bored. So I began interjecting my own opinions. For instance, if I don't like an audition, I'll grab their arms. And if they still don't manage to get the point, I'll shut off the lights and moan while I have water drip from the ceiling. <laughs> and then there's the audience, and they make things all too easy. <laughs> All I have to do is pass by them during the performance. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty great life, or afterlife. You see, I don't have to worry about the things that the living worry about. Never age, don't sleep, don't get sick. Still, it's a pretty great afterlife. I guess staying here for eternity isn't so bad. The only thing is, is at the end of the day, all the people go home. They get to go back to their family. They get to go back to their husbands and wives and children and pets, dinner and gardens and sunshine and their lives. <coughs> I just wish I could find the answers. Maybe then I could leave this place. Maybe if I just found the answers. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I did just trip. Maybe I really did fall. Well, I <laughs> guess it doesn't matter now. I should probably go. It's time for me to work my magic. Mm -hmm.